trust me social media is very powerful this is the most powerful place now like trust me so you guys will not believe that judith nakitsu has been rewarded with a month of money yes because so many people carried her story even when i made video concerning her and trust me most of you you must have been seeing her pictures everywhere here on youtube on twitter on instagram facebook website and everywhere so yes i'm here to tell you guys how much they gave her and how everything happened so if you are seeing her story for the first time just get yourself relax and hear me explain her story So, Judith went to Saudi Arabia in 2019 to work as a housemaid and by getting there, the story was somehow. It was said that she worked in Saudi Arabia for more than three months. Then, she was involved in an accident, mortal accident with her boss. So, according to what the boss, this is the side of the boss and her own side or even her family side of the story is quite different so it was said that she was involved in an accident with her boss and then in the process they took her to the hospital and that was where they found out that her kidney was sorry like do you believe can you believe that story that story is not clear for me so let me tell you the other side of the family story so the family said when she went there she, before them she used to chat with them they used to have conversations some on, sometimes on whatsapp sometimes on facebook and things we are going normal not until she went silent like no one could hear from her no one could chat her she was no longer online but her brother said before then she gave him the number of her boss so when she went offline, the brother was trying to call the boss, was trying to call the boss to find out what was the reason why Judith was offline. And the boss we from telling her telling him one story to another, not until one day they chatted them that Judith was going to come back that uh, they should come to the airport and receive her, something like that. And they were so curious. So when they got to the airport the day they told them in Uganda that she would, she would be coming back to Uganda, they just discovered her in this situation. She's now having stroke and so many things and they discovered that her right kidney has been storing away. So that is clear that, it's clear that I believe that now Judith cannot talk, she cannot explain what is happening to her because based on her pictures, and the way I'm seeing her, it just seems that she cannot explain what happened to her clearly. But for the look of things, it just seems that they just falsely stole her kidney from her. Why this thing went viral? It went viral because a channel from YouTube, I can't remember their name, I will put it here. I think it's any TV, something TV. They, when they interview her, when they interview the family, the story went viral. A lot of bloggers carry the story a lot of people carry the story that was how the story went viral so sometimes in february of this year the saudi court rewarded her sometimes in february of this year so i'm going to leave i'm going to show the amount they rewarded her here <laughs> Is the amount they said they rewarded her with i think when i checked that in dollars i found something like this about the money the money does not worth her life the money did not worth her life even though she went there to work because of money but i think the money is way smaller the way smaller the money is way 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 smaller compared to what she's going through don't forget that Judith is a single mother of five. She has five children. Five children. I see her in this situation. It just is breaking my heart. It's breaking my heart. It's very powerful. So now I'm going to allow you guys to tell me your thoughts. 
what do you think about the story of Judy? Do you think the money they rewarded her is somehow good compared to a lot of story, a lot of stories we have heard, and nothing is being rewarded or nothing is being done? Do you think this one is somehow good because so many of them buy in that country and no one is talking about them? No one even took the bus to court. No one even uh, made video about them. You know. So this one for me, I think is somehow good because at least, at least the family um, was rewarded. At least that money they can start business for her. Anyways, her story is somehow how broken. Anyways, tell me your thoughts in the comment section and bless me. So don't forget to tell me your thoughts in the comment section. I will see you guys in the next video.